Greeks. There are many kind of Greeks, and if you're an option trader, you may hard both Greeks, but you perhaps you do not know exactly why they are there, and more importantly, what they can do for you. In this case, we shall be talking about only two Greeks, which matters the most in the intraday, and the strategy we are about to discuss in the next part. And that is one is the theta. Theta is the most important Greek, you can tell. And the other one is Vega. Delta, Gamma, Theta, Vega. These are the first derivatives of Black Scholes options pricing model. Now the name sound very bad, but see that is a pricing model which is the short of the most popular model and our Indian NSE, BSE, they are all adopting, sorry, NSE, BSE, there are no options. Oh, there are options, sorry. So we are adopting this model only. And these are the first derivatives of the black choice model. Derivatives means like in class 11, we have done the derivatives, right? Integration derivatives, that derivatives. You can go there and you can check that how it comes, but that doesn't need to be that thought amount of check. And I've also given you a link when, where you can check it more detail. Okay. So let's talk about the theta one. First. So in our just del one, we sold at 40, right? So let's take a live example because otherwise I'll be not able to explain theta properly. And you may not, you may have heard the metric, but you do not know maybe that how it works. Let's start with the reliance again. Reliance is liquid. That's why I'm preferring Reliance, Reliance all the time. And also we can take Bank Nifty. Let's, Bank Nifty is open. Let's check Bank Nifty. 19,300, okay. And let's go to an option calculator, which does that. The calculator which we have in our office, it doesn't do that kind of calculations. You can use this one. And also we can use Sensible. So I'm touching Bank Nifty options and uh, I'll be touching 19,300 call options. I'll be selling that, adding that position. My expiry is 14 May. So the maximum profit is the option price, which is showing it 499.17 into 20. Okay, it is coming fine, matching. The probability of profit is a very weird concept. Okay, and you must be thinking that why if the bank nifty is at 19,300, the chance of going down and chance of going down, going up is 50, 50, right? But it, it is not actually. The probability of profit comes from the option price. And uh, if you see, you can tell one more cool thing that if you see the prices here, see the price of 19,300 C is 499. And the price of 19,300 P is 506. So the market is bearish as per the PCR theory, okay. So this is the theory that if, uh, and it is an asymmetric arbitrage also, that if the option is trading at the same same value and you are seeing and the difference of the price between the put options and the call options, if the put options, options has more premium, then uh, you can say that market is fearing that the market can crash, okay. So, and that's how and some complicated other stuff, which you can read there, the probability of profit comes, it doesn't matter. So go to the Greek section and make the Greek in rupees. Okay, this is another complicated part. So tomorrow you'll be making 9,922 rupees if everything is fine. Tomorrow means Monday. Okay. Now there are like 20 days. Now you may be thinking that how much days we have till the expiry? 9995. Okay. And if you are dividing by that date, sorry how much time we have one two three four five so we have five days so you must be thinking that each day we should have made 19,900 rupees 99 rupees right because we have this amount and we have five days so why not we are making the same amount every day so this is the most important and most confusing thing because 
see one more thing here the theater doesn't move in a linear way it moves in an exponential way the massive amount of theater decay works at the end of the day which is the thursday so that's why the thursday everybody tells that great bang nifty on the thursday you'll be getting a massive theater decay like that so this is asymmetric the 19905 you are seeing you are should be getting in the five days you should not be getting the same amount each day so the more time the more premium you will be getting and this is the exponential decay which i am talking about so initial days you shall be getting the slow decay and the more time goes it will be more faster like that so the more time the more premium you will be getting and the more exponential decay will be because there is more uncertainty and this is a seller's advantage and tomorrow how much you will be getting you can see from the greeks here and this amount will change tomorrow again okay and this varies each day and this is not linear so this is the three things you need to know so the most important thing what which you have learned right now is that if you are selling options since monday and if you are selling option in tuesday there is always more chance of making money in the tuesday than monday because the effect of theta is more in the tuesday that is the only point i have talked about theta right now and also if you are selling the options at 920 and if you are selling the options at 1230 you shall be more make, making more money if you are selling the options at 920 considering all the other factors stay same because that is more time right so the more the time you'll be getting more premium and it will eat more okay so we we need to enter as soon as possible in intraday and we need to hold the positions as long as possible in intraday so that is the most important takeaway in this theta concept now we shall be discussing about the most important thing which is volatility or vega so you guys must be thinking that if we are entering at 915 exactly we shall be making the highest money but i'll be telling you that it is not the case you shall be losing money if you are entering at 915 but you shall be making more money if you are entering at 920 why is that so for that i have a chart here let me just add everything yeah got it so by entering 915 you shall be making loss but entering at 920 you shall be making profit so what kind of concept with the is, is that we shall be getting more theta decay in the 915 right to know that we need to see the chart of the india vix vix means volatility and see suppose let's talk about this chart only suppose you are betting that uh, this will not go above this line and suddenly you can see there is a spike like this like this one so what will happen you will be getting scared that it can make huge more green candles like this and your position will be totally gone so when a huge candle like this happens the premium of all the options rises because the market fears that what will happen next because it was falling so small 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 candles and suddenly it is going up like that so that is all volatility is all about and options is all about the insurance right you are telling that it will not go above this line go below this line so what you want basically as a option seller you do not want market to move at all market can stay here and it shall be making money all day so that's what you want so an intraday option seller will want that market should be staying at the same place which happened in the last thursday and every option seller had made huge money and since also the last three days the market has been moving in a very good way i shall be explaining that okay sorry i went out of the context so let's come back to the india vix let me scroll this one and uh, after this session if you want you can join this slack channel and you can ask me access of this channel so that you can read what i have written there that time i shall be also making notes out of this one cool see so when the risk increases the more time we have the more risks we have 
we can tell that in the next minute uh, what can happen but we cannot predict about like after one year what can happen you can predict that nifty will stay below 12000 point in the next week easily because market is bearish okay there is very rare chance that market will move up like 2000 points in nifty but you cannot tell that if nifty will touch or not touch to 12000 points after let's say one year it can happen so the more time the more risk the more volatility the more risk so risk is increasing everywhere at every every sense okay so let's come to the volatility so direction is not in our hand we do not know how market will move okay so we shall be talking about volatility only now what happens in 915 if you see in the india vix india vix tells about the volatility how india vix is constructed it is taking the atm options of nifty and calculating the vix from that vix is a property of options okay the vix is created by humans us only it is not created itself so what happens we are trading the options the atm options right and uh, the more fearful we are the more premium we are giving to the options and the more premium we are giving there the more this chart is going up so india vix chart is coming from the iv of nifty options if you do not know these terms go to the links i have given you and you can read more about the stuff there in a very detailed way i cannot cover all the things in a one hour so let's see what happens in 9 15. so what happens in the 9 15 you wake up basically in the market and after you wake up you have fomo fear of missing out okay so just type the fomo here here i'm missing out okay so this happens so this is 9 15 candle wait Oh, let me make it five minutes chart. So see the chart here. So see this candle. Huge moment, right? Huge movement is happening. In 9:15, many AMO order order got executed. So you can always see that there is a huge movement like this in the first candle, and you can easily see the visible huge weeks here. So that's why never trade in 9:15 to 9:20, because if you see the charts here. In 920, it immediately stops. It is a data driven decision. 915, there is no way you shall be trading because you can get premium at here when the IV is too much high, which is very good for you because the premiums are more, and also you can get here. But we are all unlucky guys in the stock market, right? And we shall be always getting at the down point. At least I had. And the next candle, you shall be in a huge loss. And the whole day, you shall be staying in a huge loss. So that is the thing. Do not trade in 9.15, start trading from the 9.20. So that's why the whole thing of the Vega and everything I'm telling here. Now I'll be telling one line that Vega is the chance of the option price when the implied volatility of the underlying asset moves out by 1%, not like that. So if Bank Nifty is moving up by 1%, then how much fear we have, it is decided by the Vega. And uh, you can read more about it. The First and foremost concept you are getting here that get out of the intraday positions if there is any news. If Nirmala is coming to the market and talking about something, get out of the positions. If Modi is coming, get out of the position. If some company is about to publish the result, get out of the positions. If RBI is coming to talk about interest rate, get out of the positions. So these are the cases when volatility rises and you need to get out as immediately as possible. And the most important thing here that you need to trade only from 920. Do not ever touch the 915 candle. Okay because that doesn't in that doesn't make any sense as per the vega as i just showed you in the india fix chart 